up everybody it's Michaela welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be filming my college apartment room tour if you guys watched my dorm tour last semester you would have known I was in a dorm and now I am in an apartment I share my apartment with two other girls and we have a kitchen and everything and my room is much smaller this year which I actually quite enjoy because it's less area to decorate. If you guys remember last semester half of my room was bare because it was just so much to decorate but I think I have everything almost the way that I want it. Um, I want to get maybe like a couple more things but that'll probably be like in the coming weeks and I really wanted to get this video up for you guys. If you guys are interested in applying to UAS, this is what your apartment is possibly going to look like. It's going to be very, very similar to this. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's dive in. As you just saw in the background of my video, this is my little entryway. For the purpose of this video, we're gonna turn the light on. This is my doorway. So this leads out to our lovely hallway. So we're just gonna shut that. And then right here, just like in my dorm, I have all of my masks and my keys and such. And then this is something that wasn't in my dorm. They have this photo wall behind the door. So I just have pictures of my best friends, me and Casey, just moments over the summer from the aquarium and when I went shark diving and just a bunch of memories to make it a little more homey. I kind of want to get something for this wall right here, but that is to be determined. <laughs> Moving along from this little area, this is the view from my room when you first walk in. And then over here we have my closet. So I put this curtain up just so it looks really decent in the background of my videos. A little side thing about this curtain, if you guys watched couple videos ago I had a different curtain um, Nala my cat was able to cling herself to that curtain because it was kind of like a sheer mesh ish material and she kept pulling it down because I'll show you guys in a minute but it's literally held up by command velcro strips so this one is a little more structured so she can't really hook on to it I found out literally two minutes before filming this video that she can hook on to these but hopefully she won't be able to yank it down so this used to be my best friend michelle's and now she has mine and i have hers <laughs> but as mentioned this is my closet this is what i was talking about it's literally held up with a cheap curtain rod and some command hooks but we are going to oh my gosh this is so unstable but we are going to open this up here is my closet oh Nala pulled one of my shirts off the hanger, got that fixed and hung back up. But up here I have my extra tough box, I have my Doc Martens, and I have some new food that I want to try to get Nala started on. I have all of my shoes so Nala can knock it up here and chew the laces. And then I have all of my clothes. I have lots of empty hangers because I need to do laundry. But I have all of my clothes that get hung up, hung up in my wonderful closet. We are going to go ahead and shut this again. Moving on from my closet, again I have all of this empty space which needs something. I don't know what yet, but it needs something. And then down here I just have my trash can. Right next to my trash can I have my dresser and then I have this like thing right here honestly I might get rid of it and put it in like our storage room or something because it really just takes up a bunch of empty space but on top of here for now I have my old thank you cards from my small business I have my little dongle with an SD card I have my switch my tripod and all of Nala's records so her rabies her spay Everything about Nala is in this folder right here. And then moving on right here, I have my sunglasses, which I very rarely need up here. And then I have my laundry detergent. Moving down from here, I have everything for my small business. So I have my stamps to mail things out. I have my postcards that I use as thank you cards. I have my envelopes and I have all of my stickers just tossed in this container. 
Is it the best storage? No. Does it work for me right now? Yes. I'm gonna interrupt with a, another small thing. If you guys want to support my small business, Pacific Seed Co, it is always linked down below. I am coming out with new stickers almost every week or every week and a half, which is awesome. I'm working on more Southern Residence stickers. You guys really seem to like those. And there's a couple left for my first launch. So if you guys want those stickers, check the link down below or my Instagram, which is at Pacific Sea Co. Right below that, I have my dresser. So I have socks, underwear, everything in here. There's a sock peeking out. And then in here, I have workout clothes, pajamas, everything else and then down here I have more laundry detergent some hats some ice cleats and just some winter stuff that I do not need yet I think this is the last side note I will add to this video keyword I do not need my winter clothes yet it is fall but there is snow on the mountains so me and Michelle are predicting either mid October or the last week of October we're gonna have our first snow I will keep you guys updated. Right next to my dresser, I have my black cart. If you guys watched my video last semester, you guys know I built this at like 4 a.m. after Casey left and I was sad and I was crying, but we got it built. But up here is all of like my vitamins, deodorant, lotion, and such. And then down here is all of my electronics. I have a bunch of chargers, more command, Velcro strips, and then right below it is empty because Nala likes to lay in here. Right above that, I have my calendar. I like to cross off the days. It just is a cute little way to, okay. It's just a cute little way to count down the days until I get home. And October is little elephants. And right above that, I have my Whale Museum adoption certificate. Back in April, I adopted J22, which is Oreo. Oreos are my all time favorite cookies. This is another thing I really want to get framed. Right next to my cart, I have my desk. This is probably the place with the most stuff on it. Up here, I have two of my books. Um, right now, I am currently reading Death at SeaWorld. And then after, I plan on reading Salmon, People, and Place, which is a book about saving wild population of salmon. And then right next to it, this folder has everything about the Southern Resin Orcas and Oreo that I adopted, and this Family Group 2021 book. So I just keep that all organized in a folder. Right below that is the main desk part, and it comes with this light, which I really never use because I never really sit here and do homework. But it has another one of these photo boards, so I just have a couple photos. Over here I have my Lifeguard of the Year award that I won this past summer. I have a spray bottle when Nala is being disrespectful. I have my iPad and my computer here. If you guys want an idea of what my stickers from my previous launch looked like, here are two. This one is for K21 Cappuccino. And then here is another one of my stickers. It says hashtag no fish, no black fish. So like I said, these, this one is sold out, but this one and another Southern Resident design is available on my Etsy. And then my laptop is on a laptop stand. I love this. It is an essential for college. I highly recommend it. This is my glasses case. I have to put my glasses in it every night or else Nala will destroy them. And then I have my pens and pencils. Honestly, I don't know why these are here because I don't sit here and do homework. I have two patches that I want to put on my backpack. This one is from when I adopted Oreo and this one is from Mendenhall Glacier. I have this stupid little squishy thing. Honestly, I don't know why I have it, but it brings me a lot of joy. Over here, this is a rock that Casey found me at Mendenhall Glacier, so it just has some sentimental value to me. And then the last thing I have is this remote for my whale lights, which I will show you guys in a second. And then I just have my phone. Right next to my desk is my window, which would be great if it didn't have this giant metal thing covering it. So the lighting for my YouTube videos is not the greatest this semester. But anyways, this is my window and my iconic whale lights. Let me get up close so you guys can see them better. This is what they look like. They're just blue LED whale lights. They're from Amazon. 
I love them so much. I got a couple of my friends hooked on them as well. So those just run all along my window. And then right next to my window, I got this poster from the Whale Museum. It is just marine mammals of the Pacific Northwest Coast. And it just has all of the marine mammals on them. Down here, this is the box to my LED lights so I don't have to put batteries on them. I literally put it on the wall with a command Velcro strip. And then down here, I have all of my chargers. Moving away from my window, I have my tapestry. This was in my dorm last semester. This is from Amazon. I love it so much. I think it just adds some cute color to my white wall. And then right below it, I have my bed. So my bed is the same bedspread from last semester. And then I have all of my stuffed animals on here. <laughs> and I have a sleeping Nala. And then my fall colored blanket is from Fred Meyer. Can we just take a minute to realize how adorable my cat is? I also have my reading pillow, which is from Fred Meyer. This has saved my life. I highly recommend it to any college student. And then this wall right here, I also want to get something for just because it's very bare. And then right here next to my bed, I have my laundry basket, a cat toy, and I have my extra tufts. Look at these boots, you guys. They have orcas on them. I love these boots so much. I literally wear them every single day. They are the brand Extra Tough and it's their collab with Salmon Sisters. I mean, come on guys, who wouldn't want these boots? freaking orcas and then you are back at my door that is my entire room that wraps up my college apartment room tour thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed if you liked it give this video a big thumbs up hit the subscribe button down below and i will see you guys in my next video bye